Hello, my name is Seppi and welcome back to the Coffee Break in Minecraft. Today is Wednesday, May 30th, 2018. We are already at the end of the month of May. That's crazy. That's just insane. And um, yeah, this also starts to cause a little bit panic on my side because I had some goals for this year and uh, well, now we are about to enter the six months of the year 2018 and so far all my goals seem to be super far away so that's not good, that's not good at all. But here, yeah, so we are still on the expedition. We are still on the expedition with a goal to find a Mesa biome. Last time we found the second Mesa biome of the expedition, but we haven't found a mine shaft. So this was a little bit um, disappointing. But yeah, it is what it is. I am on the way back home. Immediately after I turned around and started the long way back home. I found a Mesa biome, so yeah, this was good. I got all the rails I wanted to have for the future rail system. And now it's just uh, the challenge of getting back home. And I think we are getting closer because the needle of the compass starts to point uh, this way. So I can't travel all the time to west anymore or straight towards west i now need to tilt a little bit a thousand which which is interesting which is super interesting this means we are getting closer to to our home which which is awesome and um yes yeah, so summer summer is here it's the end of may and wow it's, it's super hot i'm currently reporting from a 35 centigrade hot office. That's fun. That's that's awesome. Oh man, I I feel so exhausted and I try to somehow record this very episode of the cover break because yeah, that's that's how everything is. So that's that's how the the coffee break is because it's it's the story of my life, the story of the struggles I have with the life and um, yeah, one of my biggest struggles is speed. It's, it's just summer. I, I don't like summer. Summer is really annoying. However, on a Monday evening, we were once again at the river, the mine. We were at the old bridge, the, um, I think it's called the old, the old mine bridge, which is really a nice place usually people come together to drink some wine on top of that bridge and uh, so did we. We had some wine and we, we sat on that bridge to just enjoy the evening. In the evening it's, it's super amazing, it's super awesome because it's well around 20 centigrade or so which is super comfortable so it's, it's really nice to sit outdoors but until the the evening starts you have to survive the heat of the, the of the day and that's stressful that's super exhausting i think i would have died without the fan we have in our office but even the fan is not good enough or powerful enough to really help us dealing with the heat so yeah that that's that's once again the, the super demanding thing, but well, it, it is what it is and uh, right now it's super hot. The high temperatures also result in the fact that I haven't done anything on Sunday. Well, I of course watched the Formula One race, but um, after the Formula One race, I at least managed to continue working on the puzzle. I'm still trying to finally get this thing done, get this thing completed. And with this heat currently going on, with this heat wave going on, I at least had, it, it, it was the best thing to do. Instead of just lying around or so and waiting for the sun to set, 
I decided, okay, let's let's try to continue with the puzzle. And yeah, this, this was good. Made some progress. So cool, cool indeed. But aside from this, I haven't done so much else because oh man, it's it's way too warm. It's way too demanding. Summer is crazy. Summer is it's my least favorite season, as you all know. So yeah, that's that's bad. That's that's really bad. Um, cave chicken. Yeah, there was a cave chicken. Very interesting. Yeah. What else? On um, Monday. Monday was quite okay, based on the fact that I helped to reorganize one of our labs and it's a lab with an air conditioning system. So the the temperature in the room was was much more comfortable. So it, it was good. It was it was a, a nice work because it, it was not so hot. So th this was good. This was really nice. I'm also in the process of doing some reviews for this conference, as you know, and well, so far, the the submissions I have to review aren't that great and often even disappointing. I mean, the one I tried to or I started to review yesterday. Ooh, ooh, forest fire. What's going on here? Um, where, where, somewhere, somewhere is apparently a lever pool, but where, where, where's the, where's the source of this, this heat? Aha! Oh dear, this, this poor chicken is on fire! No! Okay, we, we have some, some roasted chicken over there. Um, hmm, that, that's interesting. Okay, we have some kind of underground lever pool, which is so hot, speaking of hot things, that just started a forest fire over here. Crazy. Crazy times. And now I'm challenged to somehow find my way up here. So I hope I can do this. I hope I can. Yes, yes, I can climb up here. This, this is nice. Awesome. Cool. Um, yeah, I, I start to read the paper and I think, hey, wow, that, that that's a cool idea. That That's really a great concept. I, I, I think that's Wait, H have I turned around in the process of climbing up here or why do I suddenly need to walk this way? That's, that's, that's confusing. Or was I walking all the time in the wrong direction? Huh? Okay, I, I, I'm confused. May maybe it's just the heat. This could be also a side effect of the heat that I, I can't really sink clearly anymore. <laughs> so, oh man, I start to, to hallucinate or so. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah, it's it's getting crazy. Summer, summer is bad. Summer is bad for good old Zevi. But um, yeah, so I, I think, hey, wow, that that's that's an awesome concept. I, I really like this idea. Then I continue to read and I see, okay, um, maybe you got something wrong here with the with the theory. Continue to read and I discover even more flaws. And in the end, I'm super disappointed and. I have a lot of red remarks on uh, the on the paper, which which is just sad. Th this is really pure sadness because I want to to see those, those great ideas being published, but then they make it so hard. And not only that, they make it so hard for me to say, okay, we can maybe accept this paper. I also like to, to write good reviews, which means I need to put a lot of effort into writing a review for this paper where I have so many remarks because I have to write down all of those remarks. It, it would be so easy if I could just say, well, this is bad, reject. No, no, I, I have to provide some, some improvements, some suggestions, especially as I am often pretty disappointed when one of my papers get rejected and I don't even get constructive feedback or so constructive ideas how I can improve the paper. So yeah, it's it's just just a thing I have to do in order to to write a good review. I have I have to write down everything, but that's of course crazy task and um yeah I, I tried I haven't finished even on on Tuesday, so yeah, I have to continue today, which which is bad for, for my uh, planning, for my schedule, because I wanted to 
to finish all the reviews by today and now I still have one I haven't read it so far so I'm not quite sure what I can expect from the last paper I hope I really hope it's it's the diamond I really hope it's it's something that is super cool super amazing and I can just say all right you did everything correct you did everything right don't have any remarks congratulations also Th this would be awesome but no so far um well, I'm I'm uh, I'm excited. The topic itself seems to be interesting, so I'm looking forward to review this paper. I just hope I'm not getting disappointed by by it. Ooh, ooh, dear! Don't don't fall into this, this pool of lever. So, yeah, that that's that's a thing. Yesterday also was a super bad day. I think I already announced it, that there's an upcoming uh, meeting and. Well, it, it was even worse. It was even worse than what I expected. So, yeah, that's that's not good. And basically, I I got the feeling that okay, everything I do is wrong. Everything I did is wrong, and um, I'm useless. And um, yeah. All the all the effort, all the all the time I invested in 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 the in the job and teaching in uh, doing all all the things I'm doing and all the the additional work hours I I did just because I I wanted to do things right I wanted to do things in a good way in a in a in a correct way and I of course enjoyed to do this. But it was not even mentioned, not even well valued. Maybe uh, it just felt like okay, it's sure that you did those things, but I don't care. And this basically leaves a little bit a bad impression. I mean, why am I then doing things? Why why am I why why do I try to to put some effort into something to to do things right when? no one is really valuing it and when just because one thing one one particular thing that not even has been communicated to me but where everyone thought i would be aware of it but no one ever took the time and yeah it, it's just a, a whole huge huge mess in the end i just think um seriously guys what has hasn't been there a different way you, you we could have handled it in the past and even now. So, yeah, in the end, it, it makes me question everything, basically. So, and I also got the feeling that, okay, no matter what I say, no matter what, what things I try to mention, what that it's it's, no one cares about it. It's it's just like okay, um, well interesting that you have this opinion but we disagree although we well that, that that's basically what what reached my end and um yeah so i'm i'm super disappointed i'm not even sure what i should do now and um if if i i mean you all know I, i'm doing this youtube thing for quite some years and I'm talking about PhD and science and so on that long but right now I even start to question whether I like to continue pursuing my PhD or if I will ever get my PhD if, if it's just a huge waste of time right now what I'm doing and if I not just should change so look for a new job and say all right what was a nice try was was cool idea what was a neat concept but guess it was not in my cards so yeah see ya see ya all and um do something else i guess because yeah it's so 
I think this really puts things into perspective. I mean, you, at least if you're if you're one of the few viewers, I unfortunately don't have many viewers, which which is also sad. I mean, it it would be really interesting to have more viewers, especially for the coffee break, because I personally value and enjoy the coffee break so much that I'm all the time just sad that it gets not views and not recognition. But um, yeah, right now, the, the lack of recognition of all the things I did, the lack of anything, it's, it's just, all right, something went wrong, so it's your fault, apparently. And for some reason, I'm apparently even the, well, it's, it's my fault, although I'm not even the primary author that a paper makes not enough progress. And I spent so much time talking to the primary author in order to explain to him what, what he has to do. And yeah, I mean, what? It, it's, it's really like, okay, this, this does not sound right, what, you, what you're doing right now. So, oh man, oh man. And um, yeah, the, the, the result of this is that I basically start to question everything. And I mean, yeah, the, the most disappointing thing for me is right now that I even start to, to question whether I, I shouldn't, I should continue pursuing my PhD or just say, all right, yeah, that, that's it. And I mean, that, this was the goal for so many years by now and um, yeah that's that's how it is right now so I don't know I, I, I absolutely don't know what I should say about it so yeah let's let's avoid this guardian temple over there I don't want to sail directly above it because in the end I, I get attacked by those those guys and that's really the least thing I like to experience today uh, getting attacked by by those guys now and um, yeah, that's that's where we are. Luckily, I mean th this month is super crazy. Luckily, uh, tomorrow Thursday is yet another bank holiday. But I think this is not a a German wide bank holiday. I think it's just a holiday that is at least in Bavaria because I'm in Bavaria. But I'm I'm not quite sure where where else this this uh, bank holiday has an effect so um yeah thursday no work so i decided okay let's let's take a day off on friday and uh, visit my parents again because i'm not quite sure i think the last time i saw my parents was easter i guess it was easter potentially it was easter yes easter was april 1st and I think I haven't been to Berlin and to my, to my parents since then. Yeah, yeah, all right. So about two months since I last saw them. So, okay, that, that's interesting. And yeah, so I thought, okay, let's, let's visit them again. And um, no, yesterday happened and yeah, I just, I'm just exhausted. I'm just done. I'm. I, I, I can't even. I can't even say anything about it. But um, yeah. So um, weekend. Weekend. I will be away, and uh, so you can potentially expect uh, out of the normal schedule coffee break. So maybe something crazy like a Monday episode of the coffee break or so. I don't. I don't know. But I don't think. Well, I. As long as I'm at my parents, I, I won't have the opportunity to record an episode. So I would need to record it uh, when I'm back. I will return on Sunday. Eh? And I'm not quite sure. Well, th this is the next problem. We had school holidays in Bavaria last week and this week, which was super awesome. I, I was at work in, in a super fresh time, so that's great. But the the holiday, the, the vacation time, ends that Sunday where I return. So 
yeah, th this could be interesting. This could be very interesting. Um, I hope, I really hope there will be no, no chaos on the roads, but yeah, we, we will see. We will see how everything pans out. Now let's, let's take a look at the list of questions because I saw before starting the recording that I got a short question from Matthew. Matthew asks, do you drink coffee? Yes, I mean, that's that's the reason why it's called the coffee break and the the French press you can see in the thumbnails on the thumbnails is my personal one. So I just took a picture of my coffee and used it and use it as as a decoration for the thumbnail. So yes, I, I drink coffee. If yes, a black black or not. Um, so there's either the option if I drink coffee then black or drink no coffee. That, that, that's a good option. Uh, I, can, I can deal with this because yes, I drink black. I, as I started many years ago drinking coffee, I my parents drink coffee with milk. So they of course thought, all right, let's, let's drink it with milk. But it never really tasted that great. I just thought, okay, that, that's how, how coffee tastes, but I still like the, the awakening effect of it. And then I, as I stated, my grandparents, my grandpa drinks coffee black. So I thought, okay, but let's do the same thing as my grandpa. Let's, let's drink coffee black. And it tastes so much better. It tastes so much better to the one with milk. So, yep black coffee it is and uh, no sugar so just just the pure coffee as it comes out of the French press that's that's the way I roll and I, I really like it it's I also enjoy the a little bit more stronger brews so that's good Ooh, dear. Uh, that, that's very good that's very delicious um, Oh, the next question is a little bit more advanced, so I will skip this one. Ooh, there's a well in uh, on an island. That's cool. I like to investigate. Ali, yep. So, um, yeah, I think next time we will hear when I'm back from from my short trip to. Berlin, I'm... Oh, snap. Ah, haha, haha. I, I was able to get out of there. I'm... Yeah, looking forward to I'm, I'm also interested to see if I can get some... Uh, oh, no. Something is spawning there. All right. Let, let, let's, let's swim back to this well. I um, really like to have something for my parents. Something... I, instead of inviting them to, to a restaurant also. I think it would be super cool if I bring some food and cook for them. So I hope, I really hope, I do have a, an idea in mind what I like to cook, but I'm not quite sure if I can get the ingredients today. So yeah, I need to see if I can get the ingredients today. Th this would be cool. I, I have an idea and then of course I need to bring all the ingre ingredients to Berlin, but this shouldn't be so much of a problem. All right, the stupid zombie, zombie is she giving up. Can I go to bed then? We will, we will see. Um, yeah, the, this is the thing I'm looking forward to. And um, yeah, I'm not quite sure what I will do this weekend because um, yeah, seeing parents is great, but right now I can't even think so far. I still have to get those reviews done, but I more importantly, have to find some intrinsic motiva motivation to to carry on, to continue on with what I'm doing, to yeah, find find a solution to my problems, to find some motiv dang it, to find some motivation again, and to yeah, just get back into the groove. But um, yeah, that's where we ended. And I hope you have enjoyed uh, this very episode of The Coffee Break. I hope you will be joining me next time. So thank you so much for watching. Until then, my name is Abby. See you.
Thank you.